Rio Rancho city manager may soon be forced out, and it could be a direct result of the Tea Party's growing political clout there. News 13's Alex Goldsmith has that story. Alex? Dick James Jimenez has served as Rio Rancho city manager for four years, but after a closed door meeting the city council held last night, he could be on his way out. Mr. Jimenez has been, I think, a beacon of honesty, integrity. Um, he's been an individual who has uh, taken the city through the most difficult economic times in our history. Rio Rancho uh, Mayor Tom Swistak had high praise for city manager James Jimenez, but it appears the city council may not hold the same view. Swistak confirmed that there will be a council agenda item next Wednesday discussing Jimenez's separation from the city. It's unclear whether that separation means Jimenez will retire or be fired, or what kind of severance package he could receive. Jimenez is the head of a board that handles bonds for housing community Mariposa. Mariposa homeowners are dealing with the possibility of dramatically higher property taxes because the developer is unable to make bond payments. Swistak doesn't think that's why Jimenez may lose his job with the city, though. How did we get to this point? Well, I, I think we may have gotten to this point because there's just maybe a, a different change in direction, and, and maybe that direction uh, may be better suited uh, with a different leader, some people may think. Rio Rancho City Council saw a dramatic overhaul after April's elections, with three new councilors taking seats. All three are supported by the Rio Rancho Tea Party. And Jimenez's last job before serving as city manager, he was the chief of staff for Democratic Governor Bill Richardson. Despite the talk, the decision to push Jimenez out is not official yet. There still has to be a vote uh, taken uh, to see whether or not there's a consensus. That vote is expected to come next Wednesday, though it's possible we'll know more before then. Back to you, Dick. All right, Alex, those city councilors were not available today. We tried reaching out to Jimenez, too, but he did not return our calls.